This brief video will discuss Brooklynella and suitable treatment options. Brooklynella, or Brook for short, has a direct life cycle, meaning the parasites live, feed, and reproduce directly on the fish. There is no insisted stage like with ick and velvet. Transmission is primarily by direct contact with an infected fish. However, there always exists the possibility that parasites can drop off into the water column and infect other fish that way. Brook is sometimes called clownfish disease because they are most susceptible to this parasite for some reason. Initial signs of Brook may look like a white smudge or mark on the fish, as seen in the left photo. As the parasites spread, it will look more like a powdery appearance on the fish as seen in the center photo. Advanced stages of Brook usually entail mucus or slime peeling off the fish as seen in the right photo. Can non-clownfish get Brook? They sure can if the parasite load in the aquarium is unusually high. Above are two examples of tangs infected with Brooklynella. If you have a microscope, you can take skin scrapes or gill clippings of the affected areas to confirm Brooklynella. These parasites look very similar to uranema, which will be discussed in a future video, but their movement under a microscope is different. Sometimes a microscopic examination is the only way to confirm a diagnosis for whatever disease is afflicting your fish. I would like to thank Dr. Charlie Gregory for providing these excellent microscopic ID videos. The best way to treat Brook is to first give the infected fish a bath or dip to knock off most of the parasites. In order of preference, from most to least effective, options include 1. A 45-60 to 60 minute formalin bath 2. A 90 minute bath using Ruby Reef Rally 3. A 5 minute freshwater dip Since many times dips and baths do not eliminate 100% of the parasites, it is wise to do follow-up treatment in a quarantine tank. For Brooklynella, this can be accomplished by dosing metronidazole every 48 hours for 10 to 14 days or with a single dosage of chloroquine phosphate at 40 to 60 milligrams per gallon. Please note that copper-based treatments are not effective against Brook. More detailed information on all of these treatments can be found on my website and forum the fallow or fishless period for Brook in your display tank is six weeks. Thank you for watching this video. See links in the comments section for more detailed information and join us on our humble.fish forum for all reef aquarium related discussion.